Hello everyone, welcome to another video from Robojax. In this video we are going to introduce the Ardu Pilot 2.8 GPS telemetry kit that we have on Robojax.com for sale. This kit comes uh, with the following items. So you get uh, the Ardu Pilot 2.8 uh, flight controller. This is a flight controller. You will also get the uh, Ardu Pilot power module. So this is a power module, which I'm going to talk about each separately. And then uh, you will get, you will also get the OSD, the Minim OSD um, module. Also, you will get uh, the GPS module with the stand. You will also get. The telemetry kit, this is a telemetry kit that, that comes with a transmitter, receiver and antenna. You will also get the shock absorbing kit to eliminate all the vibration. And you will get the servo cables. So the first thing, this is the power module that uh, you will connect it to your battery. So. So if this is your battery connector, you will have a connector here. This power, the job of this power module is to supply power to the drone. And here we have some circuits uh, that detect the power. So the amount of current that can go from here can be detected and can be reported if you, if you need to control uh, at what voltage a warning should be sent, at what voltage what should be done so you can set it so the drone can do some action. This goes to the uh, power distribution board. From power distribution board you connect it to ESCs and from ESCs you will have a servo cable that comes, this servo cable will come here. So you will connect it to the outputs So depending on your quad or hex, so we can have up to eight connections here. Uh, so if you have octocopters, you can also connect it. So your receiver will be connected here. All the channels from your receiver will be connected here. And so we have also GPS and telemetry connections here. All the ports are connected here. So this is the two more important elements. Then we have the shock absorbing kit. So this kit will be installed uh, this way. You will insert all these pieces. And the same way the other piece. So the shock absorbing kit have been attached. So these two pieces, you can then screw it from with these four points that we have onto the uh, your uh, frame, or you can put a put a double sided adhesive there to attach it. Now, as you can see, this is absorbing the shocks very nicely, so nothing will be transferred to the flight controller. So we have two two uh, adhesive double-sided tape, one for here, if you don't want to put that one, and also one for the flight controller, so you can put the flight controller on top of this. OSD kit will provide the, if you, uh, this OSD kit will embed uh, the parameters from the flight controller, such as voltage, altitude, longitude, speed, and many other information, onto the camera if you have this will be transferred onto the camera so this OSD will put all the video and print it on the video so you feed in the video and uh, to the this board and the data will be printed on the video and video out will have all the data that will be transmitted through your SPV transmitter so this is the minimum OSD uh, setup diagram from this side it gets connected 
uh, with the big cable to the power uh, to the flight controller from here we have two cable connect okay, so you connect the battery directly here so the 12 volt goes to the camera and from here it goes to the uh, OSD this is the video in the video comes from the camera and enters once it entered here the um, telemetry and all other information like current speed will be printed on the video and it will go out so we have two pins here 12 volt that goes to the video transmitter and that is the video out so the video out will also go to the transmitter so the video enters information is printed on the video and it goes to the transmitter to be transmitted we have uh, the U-Blocks um, M6 uh, GPS this GPS comes uh, with a stand this can be attached this way and this will be attached with some sample adhesive here on the um, package <laughs> some of our package from the suppliers are like this so these two are exactly the same except this one has a case so this is more protected minimo but thank you for watching please don't forget to subscribe